online and today we're at Marine Drive in Taymouth by Bovis Homes, a lovely exclusive development with sea views. We're here to see the remarkable five bedroom Kelson. Now you can see from this Kelson here, it's a truly magnificent house on three floors and it holds a bit of a secret because it's actually split level. Um, but you can see they've got that lovely composite timber boarding, the lovely balcony running across there that's a beautiful mellow brickwork and the actual brickwork's really unique because it's actually been um, ironed out which is really really nice raked out really really nice looking brickwork and we've got these lovely graphite windows and the Juliet balcony is up there as well it's also got a mono pitch roof which is really nice two mono pitch roofs which really give it a really contemporary look so let's i tell you what let's go and take a look welcome to the calson five bedroomed now i hope this 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 looks fantastic on the outside, it's so fantastic. I'm expecting it to be fantastic on the inside too. Absolutely. So this is the ground floor then yeah. that we're on at the moment. We've got a double garage to my left, yeah. the other side of this wall. Kitchen and dining area yeah. and a cloakroom behind you, but we'll take a look at that yeah. last of all, I think. I think first of all, we'll go on up to the first floor. Uh, and while I think about it, take a look at this lovely staircase. Look at the detail in that. You know I love detail. You do. Okay, let's go and take a look. Okay, so first floor, and we are to plan, which is always good, isn't it? Yeah. Right, I think if we start around at the front then, we've got bedroom two there. So we've got five bedrooms all together in this house. Yeah. So, bedroom two here, which has some amazing views at the front of the... Uh, so you've got a Juliet balcony. Yes. Really nice. Right. You can just see that little snapshot there through, you can just see the sea, just for the little snapshot there. Ah, but if you stand here where I am, you can see down the road. Look at that. I tell you what. That's lovely, isn't yeah. it? Okay, so bedroom two dimensions are three metres nine by three metres six. Nicely dressed. And blanket. And it's got a little ensuite. So again, there's a slight tile def in, in definition between the two there. 
Um, ideal standard sanitary wear. You've got the suspended toilet there, which is really nice, really good for cleaning it underneath, etc. It was really nice. Really, it's too bad. Do you know, I'm really loving the views from Marine Drive. It is absolutely fabulous. And we I aren't think even on the top No, yet. we're not. And I think as we go around this house, you'll see the views from the other room. But even look at the... I just want to point out the detailing as well. You can see just there, you've got that garage there across the road. Mm. Look at the detailing just where the garage door is there, of the, yeah. the composite boarding there. You don't have to do that, but it just makes... It shows if nice. Bovis care about how things look. Okay, so back around to the rear of the house then. So it's good landing, isn't it? it it's is. like U shaped landing. Yes. We've got bedroom five. We've been very, very lucky with the weather today as well, haven't we? Yeah. The sun is shining. So, bedroom five, dimensions are three metres nine by two metres four. And that's in width, isn't it? So, I'd say this is a single bedroom, yeah. isn't it, really? I mean, you could possibly get a double in here. There wouldn't be a great deal of room at the side of the bed, but you, you could fit a double bed in if you wanted. And you could fit a slimline wardrobe in, I think, there. Just there? Yeah. Although this is very nice. But it'd have to be a standalone. I like this. So, the window here overlooks the uh, the rear garden. Good, that's got so much potential, hasn't it? It's you can, has. I mean, yeah. it'd be great for sledging. Absolutely. You know? But so much potential. And the back, the back of this estate is not being built on either. Um that's all that's all open all, all green space. Ah. So here back on the landing we've got another window. Yeah. And then into the sitting room. Now just take a minute and take a look at this. What a gorgeous room. Dimensions for this sitting room are five meters four by five meters four, so it is a square. So let me take a look at the balcony first, then. So, okay. wow, we've got a balcony that it does stretch the entire length of the house, doesn't it? No, not entirely. Doesn't it? It doesn't go beyond. Oh the yeah, bed so you so mean? I mean the lounge. Well, in fact, I'd say the balcony is longer than five metres because the, the lounge is, comes to here. Yeah. So then you've got another, I would say, another two metres beyond it. Yeah. I mean, just look at the snapshots of the views now. Well, so I was over. Going to say from from here, actually, you've got you've got views in every direction, yeah. and you can even see the sea in that direction as well. So you've got snapshots, haven't you? So over there you've got really nice open rolling countryside. Then you've got the kind of the, the sea view there. Yeah, the mm. coast. Yeah. Mm. This is why it's beautiful. called Marine Drive. Yes. And you've got a lovely set of bifolds here. Look at how, how nice they invite you out there, don't they? But also you've got another window there. Yeah. Um, so if you just wanted a bit of fresh air, you could just open yeah. the window. So we've got a, a log burner there. Yeah nice nice feature that isn't it it's lovely yeah and, and a very contemporary log yeah. burner isn't it yeah so then we have another set of french doors yeah. there to the rear garden yeah. with two windows either side just for a little bit of fresh air yeah i mean that's it if you had both doors open both sets of doors it would be a nice sea flow breeze. of air through here yeah sea breeze. Exactly, yeah this is a beautiful rug very nice with my bare feet I mean, they've got two relatively small sofas in here. Yeah. You could fit humongous sofas. But I think in that's I think to. that's just letting the space speak for itself, though. Yeah. yeah. Really, because it is a big room. You but can even fit a really tremendous corner sofa in here if you wanted. Yeah. I mean, this room would. Well, you've got many many options yeah. with it depending on what your lounge furniture is like. As I say, we've got these, these back back doors, these front doors outside, and you've also got two little windows there, fresh air windows, just to open them up. Mm. So, let's go and take a look at the second floor. So, second floor. I think again we'll start round at the front. Let's take a look. Okay. So, this is 
the master bedroom, bedroom one, and we're above the sitting room yeah. here at the front. So you've got a set of French doors with a Juliet balcony. You really can see the amazing view from here. You can actually see the, the town just through here. Can you see it? And then you've also got another window to the right hand side with a window that, that opens just for a bit of fresh air. A beautifully dressed bedroom. I mean, you've got yeah. an awful lot of space here at the, uh, the bottom of the bed. Self rug. Fitted wardrobes. It's all included. And then we have an ensuite. The dimensions for bedroom one are four meters seven by three meters four. In the ensuite, we've got this little alcove there, which is perfect for that washing basket. You know, a little bit of space there. So really nice detailing in the tiles as well. Um, and obviously, we've got the um, ideal standard sanctuary wear, the suspended toilet, and the push flush. And we've got a nice little white towel rail behind there as well, and the shelf as well. Um, really, really good sized um, ensuite. Okay, so at the front we have bedroom three. Dimensions for bedroom three are three meters nine by two, three meters two. It's a good size double bedroom. Again, Juliet balcony, French doors there to make the most of the view. And to you know allow a lot of light into this room, yeah, natural light. light isn't it? Next we have bedroom four. This is actually the last bedroom. The dimensions of bedroom four are three meters nine by two meters eight. So we've actually done the bedrooms back to front. So on the first floor we had bedrooms two and five, and on this floor one, four, and three. Well, you can see obviously you can see the garden in a little bit more detail, and you know you can see that the possibilities of what you could do with it. Mm -hmm. and the, the, the the show house is that that was the original show house next door, as you can see. Um, and that's really nicely landscaped. But at the back, that's all going to be open space there. Um, and that'd be a nice place to uh, to just go and uh, walk the dog. Well, and, and look at the view from up there. And they've got a beautiful chair in this corner. And then your main bathroom on this floor. Let's go to the bottom floor now. Yes, let's take a look. Right, back on the ground floor then. Let's take a look at the downstairs WC. Ah, well, okay. this is tucked in here nicely, isn't it? Yeah, so this is actually under the stairs, so it's an internal WC. Yeah. And it's got a door. Oh, ah. that nice. is squeezed in there. That's pretty damn good. The old the cylinder it? tank, yeah. And the rigger boots. Yeah, it's keeping the warm. boots warm. There but this is, this is a nice little WC, isn't it? It is. So there's a space here under the stairs. And we'll just mention that this house is currently being used as the sales centre. Yeah. Okay. Ah, okay, so this is the kitchen and dining room. Ooh, this is a good sign. So you can see the sales centre there. Mm. Hey, Emma. Now, not every kitchen has one of these, does it? No. 
But actually, it gives you a good example. So Emma, what, yeah. some key points about this development, what do you know? Okay, well, Marine Drive has 26 beautiful homes in it. Yeah. They are all four and five bedrooms. There are five house types. Different house types. Now at the moment, you can see we've got the, yes. the Kelsons in yellow. They're the ones who are currently available as yeah. the date of this video. Yeah. Um, and there's a few fair leads as well available. Mm. So both ho both show homes on this development, there is availability of them. I mean, they're all absolutely stunning house types, aren't they? Yeah. So the Kelson is where we are at the moment, and we have ha actually had a look at the fair lead, which is a view home. Yeah. Right. So some other interesting points about the area. As you've already seen, there are beautiful views over the coast in that direction. There is a fantastic seafront just 10 minutes down the road with a Victorian pier. Uh, and we've got Holden Forest, which is very close, which has got cycle trails and a Segway activity centre. Is it true it's got a Go Ape as well? Oh, it has, I yes. Guess, yeah. Yes, thanks Ooh, for reminding me yeah. about that. Okay, so let's take a look at this kitchen then. We've got... Freezer. Everything is built in. And everything, everything is included. Yes. So here's your oven. Lovely mirrored effect on that one. Yeah, really it's like very that. nice, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's contemporary. You wouldn't want to get finger marks on it though. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so plenty of cupboard space. A lovely coffee machine that we might <laughs> we might get one after. Okay. So we've got lots of built-in units underneath. You've got your dishwasher here and your sink over there, okay, cupboards, uh, a five ring gas yeah. hob, yeah, and I do like this with the, uh, yeah. the large ring in the middle, the large burner, so drawers with soft clothes, your extractor fan there, ah, oh. now then, that's your washer dryer. It's all built in. There isn't it's a separate utility compact, in this it? space. It is, but it's all in here. But this is it. With a bonus size, you can just move in, can't you? Without having to worry about, oh, I've got to get a washing machine. I've you got can. to get this, that, the other. Now, I like the position of the sink yeah. because you've got a window. And if you can take a look through there. With a sea view. A sea view while you're washing up. Okay. I mean, that's... If ever there was a picture window, that's it, isn't it? Yeah. Well, you've got the pot, the, the pot and boiler there. Yeah. Really nice. Look, that's really tucked nice. away, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. In the cupboard. More cupboard space. As I mentioned, this is used as the cell centre. So this is your dining area. Yeah. I mean, you've got room for a sofa. You've also got the oversailing work surface. So you've, you've got a breakfast bar on yeah. this side, essentially. You could have some stools underneath or additional storage if you wanted. And then at the front you've got French doors. Yeah, and that's quite, so they're quite wide, aren't they? It'd be nice to have a little patio out there. All I do know, down. I think it would really, yeah. yes, like they've done there. Just so even, you know, but you Yeah, just because you've actually got a front door in the hallway, a really good front door. Yeah. So this is just additional, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Good size. Well, let's go with this. If I just pan over, this is the Kelson, as you can see. Yeah. This is the house type we're in at the moment. Yes. Um, and we're Emma and Steve from Show Homes Online, we bringing are. you another quality house, um, the Kelson by Bovis Homes at Marine Drive. Great house. Absolutely beautiful. Um, Come and take a look. The views. Well, the view sell this house on its own. Yeah. You know, every house has got a beautiful view. If you are looking for a home with a sea view, and take a look at this. It is, really is a beautiful development and I think once it's finished as well it is going to be a real sort of place to be in Tamer for Absolutely. you know. Yeah. Um, thank you for watching and take a look at our Bovis Homes playlist as well. You're on the channel now so just click playlists and you can see a lot of different Bovis designs from all over the country that we've uh, reviewed. Yes and we'll catch you on our next video. Thanks for watching. Take care, bye. <laughs>